Hey everyone, it's Monique and I'm not gonna upload like an actual video today like um, a vlog or anything like that because I just I don't have time. I'm behind you guys. I'm behind on videos um, I'm back from the cruise to Mexico. It was great. I'm currently editing that vlog right now And it's just not ready. It's that video honestly is gonna be like an old-school home movie video that I'm just uploading for the world to see um, because there's just so much footage and there's so many memories that I want to capture and so many feelings that I experienced on that trip that I don't want to forget. My video is taking a lot longer to edit than I thought it would, so I'm not finished with it. And also, I'm currently preparing for another road trip. I'm about to do something that I've never done before. I'm going to another state that I've never been before. And when I got before I got back from Mexico, I thought that I would have more time to prepare for this trip but then I ended up getting an email with a date that I have to be somewhere and I realized I had two weeks left from I think I got the email I kid you not the day I got back from Mexico and once I saw the email I realized I had two weeks before I left again for another road trip and this time I think I'm going to be gone at least for two months yeah, so I just have a lot going on, a lot to prepare for, and that just put me behind. So I just wanted to come on here, say hi, give a little update on what's going on, and soon you'll find out where I'm going and why I'm going there, because it's for a very specific reason. And oh, and I also wanted to talk about an experience I just had recently, which was pretty creepy, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of being petty, and I wanna put this person on blast. <laughs> Yeah, so after Mexico, you know, I went back to my van, started doing gig work, trying to make some money back before this coming trip that I'm about to go on now. And I was back in the van at the park, chilling, minding my business. And I look out my back window and I see someone parked behind my vehicle for quite a long time. They weren't in a parking spot, like they were in the aisle. Like they were just in the aisle that you drive around in a parking lot behind me and they were just sitting there. So I go to my back window to look and I see that they have a phone and they're recording me. This woman re was recording my license plate. Like she was making sure she got my license plate. She was recording all up in my back window. And, and I was just so confused. So I jumped up and I grabbed my camera and I started recording her because I, I don't know what's happening. This could be some crazy weirdo killer stalker. I don't know. It was so weird. I've never experienced it before. So I grabbed my camera and I start recording her. She circled my car that I know of. She circled my car two times, like one full circle, recording the whole time, stopping. She would stop on each side of my vehicle and record. And then she circled again and she would stop in the back at my license plate and she would just record and she was sticking her phone all the way out and this so I only know of her circling my car recording two times I feel like she had been there before I noticed her maybe she circled it three times I don't know it was creepy and even creepier than that was that I went out the van so that she could see me recording her so that she would know like I see you I have a camera too I can get your license plate too and she just stopped and stuck her camera out as far as she could and she just stared at me and recorded me and we were just sitting there like some doofuses really just recording each other i was sitting out the side door of my van and i was recording her with my big camera and she was just parked right there and she saw me and just like letting me know that she doesn't care that she's being recorded <laughs> the same way that i'm letting her know i don't care like i got you you got me but i wasn't even the one doing anything like she was the creepy one doing something weird anyways <laughs> That just happened, that just happened like a week ago and it really creeped me out. It was just an experience that I thought I would share. I'm, I'm really grateful that I ended up taking my back window cover down because I leave it up. You can see right now, I leave it up all the time so that the sun doesn't get in my van. And um, just this day, I decided it's a beautiful day. I'm at the park. Let me just take my window cover down. And I'm really, I'm really grateful I did. And I'm definitely going to start keeping my window covers, at least one window cover down all the time, particularly the back one since I'm in the back most of the time. But I'm really grateful that I ended up taking that window cover down because if I hadn't, I would have just been chilling in my van, making some juice and relaxing. And I would have never known that this creepy weirdo 
was circling my vehicle, recording me, getting my license plate, making sure she got my license plate. <sighs> yeah, that, that's what's been going on with me. <laughs> getting back from my trip, prepare, preparing for another trip, and being recorded by a creepy weirdo. Also recently, I just got some more security measures installed in my van. Like I wanted this video to be a, vi a video about van security, but I've decided I'm not going to show my security measures. That's just not something I want to do. But a lot of people do show their security measures. So if you want ideas, then I will definitely YouTube van life security and see what other people are doing. That's where I got some of my ideas from. But thank goodness, I just had some more security installed in my van because that was creepy. You just never know what kind of weirdos are out, are out here. Um, I always try to like be aware of my surroundings, see if there's a certain car following me. And after this experience, I'm gonna up that a little bit. Definitely, I'm not even following my own advice right now. My back window cover is down, <laughs> but I can see, I can see behind me. Like I can see out of my side mirrors, so I'm good. I'm gonna go ahead and upload this to YouTube today. I think today's September 17th. So I'm gonna try to get this up so that I upload something. And um, and then next Sunday, I'll have a regular video again. But I'm gonna get ready to get some more things done for my road trip. And I'll tell you all about that soon. Thanks for watching. Thank you all for the support, the comments. I always have majority good vibes in the comment section and I appreciate that. I appreciate you and I will see you next week.